There's this spot right here, which is where we think the guy went through. Dun, dun, dun. All right, here we go. This plate has been installed. All I had to do is go zip, zip with a couple screws. And now, da, 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 da. done. Look how simple that is. That's so easy. That's so simple. Put it down. And now we can adjust it. Put it out. Cool. There we go. And then, just to see what it looks like. <laughs> whoa, 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 so bright. And then the instructions That's say the that we have thing. to let it, um, we have to let it charge for like four days before we can actually use it so that the battery gets full charge and whatnot and everything. So we're gonna be good and we're gonna set up the solar part and then and then we're gonna let it sit for four days and then we're gonna use it. Yeah. Now, now. All right, so uh, Yep, there's that. Now we're gonna put up the solar part. Ready to put the solar part up? Yep. Kill the beans. You know exactly where to put it. Yeah. Where should we put it? We should put it all the way up there with all the other solar panels. <laughs> I don't think we can do that though. Huh? No. Can't no. put it with the other panels. That'd be cool though. <laughs> yeah. Connect it all together and be like, poof. There's. There's fire setbacks too, so you can't block the spots where the firemen have to walk on the roof. True. So you have to have a foot and a half on the side and three feet along the top. So, yeah, we can't put it all the way on the edge. Yeah. But we can put it down here anywhere below these panels. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So that's what we'll do. Yep. I'm thinking of just well, let's do it. in this little area here so it doesn't cut yeah. into the house at all. Yeah, that's probably good. Now if it rains, we don't get water damage in the house. True, yeah. The water can leak through here all at once. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put it together and we'll show you the final product as soon as we finish it. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Final product. Alright, so we're making a makeshift um, little thingy bobber for the solar part of our little security thing to go on the thing because Sean couldn't get it up there because the um, things are too heavy or too thick and the nails or the screwdriver things wouldn't go through it very well so we're making a makeshift thingy bobber he's having some fun over there doing that so much fun hi you having fun yeah <laughs> i wish i had a clamp to keep this together oh that'd be good hmm All right, so we're beefing up security so that we don't have this problem again, which I think the big issue is mainly just the whole fence issue of uh, people being able to get in through that fence. So once that goes away, we probably won't have a problem. And if they do, it's because they jump over the fence. But it's good to have security and lights. And it's so simple to put those lights up. So that was super cool to get. Yeah. Ooh, spiders, look at the spiders. Yay! Ugh. I'm gonna pick up dog poop while Sean's working on his little project here. Da 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 da! All right, we have completed our ghetto rigged version mm -hmm. of a solar panel holder, which is very weak, and I'm a little concerned about it possibly falling down. But for now, it'll work. Yep. Hopefully, it'll <laughs> work for a little bit at least. So basically, what he did was, so he put these in the wall, and then he put those together with that one, and then a nice little plank, and then the little solar thingy bobber so that it can catch some sun and get that thing shining. So we have a shiner. <laughs> I don't know what he's going off doing now. He must have thought of something. But anyway, isn't that cool? Our little uh, ghetto solar panel plank. Solar panel plank, that's what we we'll call it. Solar and, panel plank. And it's ours. It's our trademark, because we did it. <laughs> We created our own thing. Want to buy one? We'll make you one. <laughs> <laughs> it's really ghetto. Yeah. So what I'm thinking of is get a bungee cord and wrap it around the bottom and hook it up to the oh, water thing. Oh, that's a good That'll idea. It'll just kind of support it a little bit better. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's find some bungees. I know we got some somewhere. Yeah, you. 
Sean's so smart. He can like figure out all sorts of fun stuff. Luna, watch out. Luna, you cannot go outside. You have to stay in the house. If you go outside, you might find someone with a speedo or something. <laughs> and that would be weird. That would be weird. All right, so we are fixing the fence here. And we discovered that this was falling apart, so he's gonna screw that back in there. Hopefully it'll go in all right, because all these, uh, all these pieces of wood are like really, really, really in bad shape. So we're trying to fix that so that doesn't have an issue. And then there's this spot right here, which is where we think the guy went through. So if he went through there, then yeah. So we're gonna fix that up. And then there's this other spot over here that's a little wiggly jiggly. And we're going to uh, work on that spot too. So, yeah. Alrighty, we got it put together. We got a nice new board. Sean's getting the bottom ones in there. Oh yeah. And we think we saw the guy walking by in clothes this time. And he's went down the street. So, I don't know if we're going to go chase after him or if or what. But it would be kind of fun to be like going over there and go honk, honk, honk. And, be like, and it's a good thing I just bought new pants because I just hit a nail. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh yeah, you got you got a big old light rip right there too. That's from keys and stuff. Yeah. He needed new pants. So we went and got some new pants earlier. So here we go. Here's our new fancy fence right here. Bam, look at that. Beautiful. Alright, let's run up through and we'll ones. do a test and see if we yep. need to screw anything else in. Yep, we want to make sure that we got a nice secure area so that uh, weekend, things don't here. happen again. Oh, that's huh. nice. mm. The most part. So one of these days we'll need to like replace all these, which it's actually not that bad. And now that we know that we can uh, open up both of these here, we might be able to actually put some uh, some boards in my car instead of having to borrow someone else's car and stuff. So yeah, there we go. Welcome to the end of the video today. So thanks for watching and uh, enjoying us putting together a more secure fortress for our house. So, thanks for watching, and if you haven't subscribed yet, click on the little faces below, and if there's any videos on the uh, right hand side, go check out those out and see uh, what other things we've done recently. And, we do our videos Monday through Friday, so you can enjoy them every day during the week, and you never know what's gonna happen each day. So there you have it, and, we do this because love. Deuces. <laughs>